Hello everyone and welcome back to Portal 2. Alright, so we got some more aerial faith plate tests to do. So this one should bring us right back over here. Alright. Oh dear. Well. That that's the general idea. But uh Obviously, didn't quite work out the way it was supposed to. Something changed. What changed? I don't know. <laughs> don't get hit in the head with the cube. Oh, it's gonna drop a... okay. So once that comes through, it's gonna land over here. We need to send it over there. So... okay. How to get it over there is the question. is on the other side of... oh. Hmm. I wonder... Would that work? If it goes in at an angle... Still cleaning out the test chambers, so sometimes there's still trash in them, standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Wait, what in the world? You don't have to test with the garbage. It's garbage. Press the button again. Uh, what is this? This doesn't look like garbage. Huh. That's, that's interesting. I'm gonna hang on to that. That definitely doesn't look like garbage. Okay, so that ended up down there. Hi there. Can I, can I just take all of this stuff with me? Oh, hey, there's a... Oh. Well, that's easy. Perfect. I wonder. I'm gonna come back to this because I wonder if that radio will do the same thing as the radios in the original game where it'll uh, if you get it in the right position it'll make some sort of static noise or something. I wonder if it'll make the same noise with the before cinder. when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you and I'm sorry. 
You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head, which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. <laughs> It does. It does make the same noise when you disintegrate it. I don't know, this just seems, it seems really important. Like, it seems so out of place that it should, like it really meet, like it means something. Or no, everything makes that sound when you disintegrate it. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, that's interesting. I'm gonna have to... Can I get... I can't get anywhere else, can I? In this in this situation. Oh! Ooh, don't fall down, please. Um I don't, I don't think so. That's just a wall, it's not a hole. I feel like there might be somewhere else I can get to, but I'm not going to worry about it right now. I'll have to play around with it later and see if I can figure anything out. Hey guys, just a quick update on the situation before we continue with the video. I did do a little more playing around in this level, and there is a secret transmission that you can get if you go to the right spot. So we are going to make our way over there. Um, what we have to do, let me put this down for a second, we need to get all the way back over to uh, to the beginning or to the start of the level all right and you you may have noticed this um, it showed up on my screen at least once uh, probably more um, but I didn't really I, I I saw it but I didn't pick up on it at the time um, there is a hole. Well, there's a. Right there. And again, I saw it, but I didn't really. I didn't pick up on the fact that the glass is actually not there. The glass is completely shutter, uh, shattered. So, what you have to do is use your aerial faith plates to get you into that room. So, if we hook myself up here and well, actually I gotta hang on uh, do, 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 do. back over there there we go um, dang it oh well uh, if we do this uh nuts uh that's not gonna work is it hang on i gotta I gotta shoot the other one into that one there we go but i have to carry the radio in there so i can't do it at the time of, of at flight time so let's see if i can make this work a second time i made it work once yeah and so here we've got another den of the rat man. And if you go in the right spot, there's your second transmission. Interestingly, it's not um it's not triggering an achievement for me. So I wonder if I
Oh, it got louder and then it just ended. So I didn't, I didn't, oh, there, there it goes again. Um, it's not triggering an achievement for me, which is kind of interesting because I don't remember ever doing this before. Um, and I, I forgot to look up my achievements before I started recording this to see if I had already gotten it, but I don't remember doing this before, so it's, that's kind of odd. But, um, gosh, that's annoying. I didn't wait around last time, so I didn't realize how loud it got. <laughs> I'm gonna put that over there. Um, I didn't realize how loud that thing got. Um, so you've got another piece of artwork here, companion cubes, smooth jazz fails. <laughs> Just playing smooth jazz. Um, nothing is real. And that's about it. This thing looks like, um, huh, this thing looks like moon phases, doesn't it? I just realized that, um, because I didn't really spend too much, t again, like I said, I didn't spend too much time in here. As soon as I found it, I hopped out and, and uh, did the recording. So yeah, that looks like the, the, the phases of the moon there. Um. These are just notes, I guess, of smooth jazz. I don't know. I wonder if these notes actually uh, mean anything if you play them. And got some companion cubes, and I don't know. Are those hands or waves? No, these are waves, I guess. It looks like water. Huh. I don't know. Anyway, uh, that's about all there is. I didn't. There's no other. There's nowhere else to get in here that I know of, and it doesn't look like there's anywhere to use that CD that we found either in here. So, still not sure about that. But, um, but that's at least the last transmission from your, from the radios. So, and I'm sure, like I said before. The radios were used in a kind of a hybrid uh, alternate reality game thing uh, that Valve did to promote Portal 2, so I'm sure that this radio message has some sort of meaning behind it. Um, but you're gonna have to look that up because I I'm not gonna I'm not gonna mess around with that outside of the game to figure all that out. But I'm sure someone has somewhere has someone's I'm sure someone somewhere has done all that work already. So. Um, Alright, so that's pretty much it. I'm going to leave the radio here, because it's super annoying. And I actually didn't need to shoot that portal, because I can just hop out the window. So, uh, anyway, that's it. So, uh, back to the video. Hm. Well, there's how an aerial faith play is put together. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry, I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. <laughs> actually, the funny thing is it actually didn't startle me. I think it did the first time I played it, when I played this, but... Um, I didn't even remember that this time, and it didn't startle me at all. Which is kind of funny. Yeah, this, uh, this place could still use a little bit of work. Look at that. Alright. Er. 
Oh, look, it's... Did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Thanks. Destroy my companion cube. Oh, no. I fizzled that one, too. Oh, well. We have oh, hey. our houses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. There was a uh, little blue guy again. Funny thing is, doesn't it leave like a, a giant scar on the side of the... Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay. I thought it did. up there with the cube. Oh, wow. I completely missed it fly through there. Okay. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. Nee. Sure, GLaDOS, I won't take anything with me. I promise. <laughs> She's gonna get so mad at me. <laughs> well, she'll probably just vaporize it, honestly. Yeah, see? I think that one was about to say, I love you. And they are sentient, of course. We just of have course. a lot of them. Of course. Can I go back and get another one? Or is the door broken? Or closed? Yeah, this door's closed. <laughs> of course they're sentient. Of course they are. I believe you. You wouldn't lie to me, GLaDOS. Would you? Of course not. Oh, it's the Emancipation Grill. This next test involves Emancipation Grills. Of Remember, course. I told you about them in the last test area that did not <laughs> have one. Yes, I, I, I remember. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There. If you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. Trying to, I'm trying to remember what recognizance means. What does this do? Oh. Do, 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 
Do, do, do. A booski. Oh. <laughs> do not destroy vital testing apparatus. Sure, she'll have something snarky to say about me completing the test before she got back. Oh, Chapter 3 The Return. You're not going to give up, are you? sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? No. There, try it now. What happened, right? I was just lying there. You thought I was done. Mm, this plate must not be calibrated to someone of your generousness. I'll add a few zeros to the maximum weight. You look great, by the way. Very healthy. Try it now. <laughs> Big bird, right? Couldn't believe it either. You seem to have defeated its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. Huh. I don't know if you're supposed to be able to make it up there. Um... to listen to what to what he's got to say ow Do, 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 do. Whee! Those things really do spring you up at a, at a a uh, high rate of speed. Where's the, uh, oh, it's here, okay. And that, oh, that opens the door, okay. All right, well, then I need to get over there. So. You. 
sailing through the air majestically, like an eagle, piloting a blimp. Man. <laughs> How would an eagle even pilot a blimp? All it has is talons. Can't really grab onto any of the controls. I wonder if it could guide the blimp if you tied the blimp to the eagle. Enjoy this next test. I'm going to go to the surface. It's a beautiful day out. Yesterday I saw a deer. If you solve this next test, maybe I'll let you ride an elevator all the way up to the break room. And I'll tell you about the time I saw a deer again. <laughs> I saw a deer. Where's my little blue ball friend? I need to break that beam. And I s suppose I need to do it with that box over there. Okay. up here. Alright, so... Uh, I need to take this down here. Okay. I need the box that I so callously left behind. Am 
my uh, weighted storage cube. The test. Yay! I didn't see the deer today. Oh. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. Boo! Did you see two humans? Was one of them carrying a crowbar? That would be kind of funny. Where would she have seen them, though? What? is going on here uh, the energy bridges or I'm sorry the hard light bridges yeah that's exactly what they are um well tell you what we're at a perfect point to stop and uh, pick up next time so thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed this please leave a like share it with your friends and subscribe if you want to see more until next time bye